So we're going to look at how to upgrade the firmware inside the BL3GRC gyro today. So we've fired up the uh, PC setup tool here and we've also connected up the gyro via USB. So as you can see here we have a message saying BL3G is plugged in via USB. So then we go ahead and press the enable tabs button and up the top here we find the upgrade tab and press that. And uh, here on this page you can click on the message here and we can see which firmware is already inside the gyro and we see we have version 2.2 so we now will upgrade this to version 2.3 so this is achieved by hitting the big green button here launch upgrade and we get a window like this come up and you should also see here gyro connected message inside this window in blue color so you need to wait maybe one second or so for this to come up and then go ahead and choose the file that uh, that needs to be uh, downloaded to the gyro and uh, press that button and you look for the uh, particular file, the .efu file that you need and open it up and you see a message here saying file correctly loaded this simply means that the uh, file format has been understood by this tool and everything looks okay. We then need to enter the code words here and uh, the code words will be uh, provided in the package software or you can also find them on the frequently asked questions section of blue light website so let me just bring this into view which is the, um, the code words we have and we can uh, simply copy and paste these so I double click here copy and paste here double click copy and paste double click copy and paste double click copy and paste once that is done it can be checked and if they're all okay it tells you so and then just simply hit the upgrade button and the progress is reported on this bar here first it erases the old software and then it puts in the new software and uh, you can see the duration here should be less than 20 seconds for this process okay so when all done simply hit the quit button and then you'll hear a, a noise uh, USB noise and you will get a pop-up window here saying you must unplug the gyro so first of all get rid of this window by pressing OK you're reminded here to power cycle the gyro so let's just do that unplug and plug back in so now the gyro is calibrating and you'll notice that the uh, message the red message has gone here and just to confirm we can press this again here and you can see you need to press it a couple of times that the new firmware inside is now version 2.3 so that's all there is to it